So a couple years ago, I remember making this photo manipulation tutorial inspired by an old memory of mine of catching fireflies as a kid. I remember like uh, staying up all night trying to figure out this technique of how to work this piece with not only premium stock or photos you buy, but also free pics too. And it worked. The technique, which was to get a jar with a white background to blend into its surroundings actually came out pretty great. It got remade a bunch and it's one of my favorite tutorials to date. Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Melody Nieves. Today I'm going to be making part two to this memory with a Procreate Digital Painting Glow. Fireflies are soft-bodied beetles known for their famous fiery bellies. The summertime beetle, also known as a lightning bug, glows as a mating call to attract males and bait using a bioluminescence compound, reacting with oxygen within the female's belly. Just like my tutorial, I'll build the whole image around the firefly, using them both as a subject and as a lighting source. Now originally, the idea was to fully illuminate this with this picture as a guideline for all the lights. As for the rest of the sketch, I'll follow the same photo. This hair is also a lot bigger than the models. I don't mind the shortcut, I just feel like fuller hair will make for a more intimate shot. So I tried out a few choices for the colors and landed on this, matching the top to the rose. Base, shadow, and highlights are still my go-to. Thank you. 
but I will have to make the sketch lighter to see. And because of the lighting, all the shadows hit the hands. If I work a little dark in the beginning, I won't have to add so much light later on. Sit on the couch and chip away at it kind of paintings like if we're watching tv or movies i still get to have much needed time with my honey while i paint which i love because this is gonna take some minutos huh i don't know probably like 30 to 50 hours by the end I'm really liking this process, but if you want to see more paintings in Photoshop, just let me know. The hardest part of any painting, I think, is the middle, the cleanup phase. Like this is when artists usually beat themselves up, right? Saying things like, oh my God, what is this face? Is it ever going to look right? Should I give up? So I try to work through this phase as fast as I can, because realism is all about layering. And you should let yourself be messy, at least in that initial phase. Now for the light.
Around this part is when I finally realized the extra fireflies came off a bit messy, but if I keep two in there, I can at least make sure the main lighting still illuminates her and the flower. Details are next. I'll be real with you. Like, studying these bugs? Oh my god. Like, you ever look at a bug and just think it looks crunchy? I actually started reading about fireflies, aka lightning bugs, aka glow worms, because of this painting. Not only do they eat snails of all things, but the ladies have brighter lights than the males. Okay, with the shine on, shine off. Smaller, heavier brushes help lay in those final details, and then this is the final painting. Thank you all so much for watching me work. Links to the references and the book mentioned is in the description. And if you have any questions, just let me know.